thank you very much for clicking on my video. A quick word before we begin. If you are new to Trove or wish to start a new account, feel free to use the first link in this video's description. You'll help the channel greatly. What's up guys? Welcome back to Trove. Welcome back to Mad Sunday. And I know, I know, every time I say I'm gonna stick to filming uh, Mad Sunday videos on a regular schedule, like every Sunday, um, yeah, I fail in doing so. So no, I'm not gonna say anything today, not even gonna mention it, even though I just did. I'm gonna jump right into it. I found one interesting costume on our um, modding section on our uh, Discord server. And um, keep in mind, if you've left mods in there before and I haven't showcased them, I will definitely do so. I am trying to uh, be consistent with the series and uh, put out as much community uh, created modded, uh, well, mod as much modded content as possible, basically, right? That said, today we got a special mod from uh, one of our uh, special mod creators, So Totally Josh. Uh, let me find it in my, there you go, there you go. So Totally Josh made the following catchy costume. Look at that, there's a preview, uh, there's a preview thumbnail right there, there's a preview image. That's basically what caught my attention. It's called, I guess, 5T3AR Fox? Is that a reference to some um, some uh, movie or something? Star Fox? You let me know in the comments. Other than that, it says um, it replaces. Oh no. Is this as a punishment? Because I didn't know the reference? Oh well, retry. And we, <laughs> we are back. Please don't crash me again. It wasn't a crash, it was just a uh, loss of connection, but anyway. Um, where was I? Oh yeah, I was checking the modding interface. Um, Star Fox, or whatever it is pronounced. Um, replaces Draculite's Dreamolite costume. God, I hope I got it. And uh, Mounting Shadows sta Stave? Stav? I don't know. Includes costume gear effects. I'm uh, really curious. Usually so, so totally Josh makes some uh, really... Uh, eye-catching VFX, some really quality VFX, and anyway, and custom sounds. Um, I hope my recorder is gonna catch that, I usually have my show sounds as low as possible, just not to interfere with my with my coherent commentary, right? With my professional comment, yeah, of course I'm kidding. Right, um, I guess I should probably figure out, uh, well, I should probably jump on the Dreamlight costume, I should probably jump on my Dracolite, first and foremost. So that said, let's pick the uh, little Draco. Wow, beautiful, beautiful outfit on my <laughs> on my Draco. Do I have the Dreamlite costume? The mod is mentioning and Yes, I do. A uh, costume for the Dracolite. How dreamy do you want to be? Okay, let's put it on. Wow, already, <laughs> I already uh, noticed the massive cannon. I should probably check its um, weapon. Dream? Is this the weapon? I, uh, I'm not entirely sure. Okay, so I, I really had a hard time figuring out uh, what stuff I gotta replace. I replaced the costume with the Dreamlight. I also replaced the uh, Mounting Shadows. Uh, apparently that's a weapon style, but I can't seem to find a suitable head style. Maybe we can uh, pick this together, but I don't know. Um, I don't think the costume comes with anything, so... I guess this Meg Pilot headgear will, will work just fine, and uh, yeah, there, there you go. That's the um, that's the uh, gist of the costume. Let's play a little with the uh, VFX. Whoa, wow, nice. I like that. I like the dragon I had on my uh, Draco. Right, so let's play with the VFX. I really noticed it shoots um, like projectiles, which is rather interesting. Let's check the other. I should probably um, wait a second. Let me go. Let me go to a, um, to a Uber world. It's gonna be better. Because I want to load the little cannon on my shoulder just to see it in action. Oh, there you go, there you go. I think it, it notifies me that it is, uh, it is indeed loaded. Let's find a um, unsuspecting target and unleash hell. Oh, that was nice. Why, well, of course, matches the overall uh, green theme of the projectiles. Let's shoot another one. This time into the street, and it's good. It's night time because we can see the um, uh, we can see the effects better. Okay, there you go. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Let's check the other skills as well. Let me throw the little bomb on the floor. Oh, finally, these... Oh, wait, is this the reskin? I'm not entirely sure. This is reskin? I think it is. Pretty sure that's not the uh, usual Draco bomb. Honestly, the, um, the explosion uh, VFX to this bomb is uh, kind of underwhelming. I would have expected something larger. 
and definitely with a, with a little bit more green to it. Right, uh, let me see, what other stuff do I, uh, do I have to my, uh, disposal? I think that's it for the skills, right? I don't think I missed anything. And now, for the grand highlight of this mod, I was wondering what's up with this, uh, preview image. I, I, I thought this is a mount I had to also get, but no. Check this out. Damn, dude, you transform into a freaking spaceship. Granted, it moves rather derpy. But once you catch some air, look at this. You got a freaking spaceship that of course shoots projectiles. Oh damn, I, unfortunately it doesn't last that long. So I, I guess I'll have to wait for another uh, turn to play with it. But that's so epic. Look at this, this is so epic. Look at this. <laughs> this is so funny, you got like a personal spaceship in Trove. We should have had like... um. It's, uh, it's nose, uh, maybe that's the natural position for a spacecraft to travel at, who knows, I'm not an expert in, uh, in this field. But the nose of the spaceship appears to be a little bit too tilted down in the front. Wish it was more, I don't know, flat. But it's pretty cool nonetheless, definitely pretty cool. <laughs> Look at my, uh, my silly raptor berserker trying to uh, keep up with my spaceship, we got no chance. Oh, something I noticed, it should probably have like afterburners, right? A little bit more effects on the um, on the back tail of it. Imagine like three. I can see three engine propulsion systems, right? Imagine them having like afterburner effects, like some dragons have. I think that's gonna make it a little bit uh, a little bit cooler. Other than that, it's pretty dope as it is. Look at that. Damn, son. Your personal spaceship. Great mod. Great job. Uh, so totally, Josh. Great mod indeed. Oh my god, I, I, ju I just had an idea. Uh, let me uh, let me try uh, put it in action. Look at this abomination right here. You weren't ready for this, were you? <laughs> it's a bit it's strange. It's like the Dreadnought now has a freaking spaceship following, uh, following it around. That's pretty dope. It doesn't look like one single creature. It's got like some buffer space right there, buffering space, but, uh, <laughs> but still looks... From the above, <laughs> it looks rather menacing. That's so silly. Reminds me of the Hydra mod. But there you go guys, this is the uh, Star Fox costume or 5T3R Fox costume. The spaceship alone is what makes it. This is so so cool to play with. Imagine making like an obstacle course for you to fly around in this. Yeah, this is pretty epic. Thank you so much to so totally Josh for placing your mod in our modding section on our Discord server. Great job on it. And thank you so much to you for watching. As always, links, or rather link to the specific mod I just showcased can be found in the video description as always. Thank you very much for watching this video. Remember to like it if you enjoyed it, dislike it if you did not, and don't forget to leave a comment saying, well, anything that crosses your mind. This will help the channel greatly. I'll see you on the next one.